this will be our first show of the year and we're gonna have a good time tonight y'all i'm super super excited <laughs> right um, now we are about to bring on my dear dear friend yes. my dear friend mr daryl Sema. <laughs> you went away huh you went away uh-oh uh-uh we're here Oh, okay. Can you see me? I see you. Okay. All right. Now you just went away again, but you can see me? I can see you. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Let's, yeah. let's do this thing. Let's do this thing. That's what I'm talking about. Let's go do this. You can't even read it. That's right. <laughs> Introducing the one, the only Mr. Del Simmons. All right. Yes. Hold, 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 everybody sit down. Sit down. Ain't no big thing. <laughs> yes. Mr. Del Simmons. Huh? I want to say Happy New Year to everybody. Happy, Happy New, New Year, Year to you too. How's everybody? Everybody is fine. Everybody's Look, good. Is that the Mrs. Hello, Hello. Oh, Yeah. You beautiful. Yes, yes. We are so excited tonight to have you with us. You are the first show of the year. Yes, 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 yes. yes, yes we need something on. special. As soon as Big Sexy get her stuff together, she's going to be sending you something. Oh, I'm going to be so, waiting on you. Oh, yeah. It's not going to be nothing but just a pile of dust. <laughs> no, I'm just playing. It's going to be so <laughs> good. <laughs> so listen, Daryl, yeah. for those who are watching, please tell them who Mr. Daryl Simmons is. Daryl Simmons is uh, just a poor little guy from Jackson, Mississippi. <laughs> that's it really no no you got to tell them from the time you start let's start from high school where did you go to high school oh man all right i graduated from Callaway high school Woo -woo -woo. Boo. Oh, oh lord <laughs> okay, i played, I played, I played, I played the band i was a trumpet player um trumpet player yeah trumpet player uh yeah. from there um uh, Started playing. My brother had a group back in the '80s called Show Enough. Me and yeah. Jack, I played with Show Enough, and we toured all around the world, everywhere. Did all the all the good stuff. Um, from that point on, I started working in production with with different bands and with sound companies and so forth. Mm -hmm. And uh, from there, it just led me where I am now. I've worked with everybody. I've been in the business over 35 years. I've worked with everybody, anybody that you name, especially on the Southern Soul uh, Souls uh, music circuit. I work with everybody. I mean, man, mm -hmm. I've been on shows from BB King to uh, uh, to Anissa Hamm. Okay, uh, come on now, come on. Now. <laughs> yes, yes. Come on. <laughs> I, 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 I know quite a few people. Uh, uh, big Rob described me on on some talk show I was watching where he was saying I was like a big brother on on the circuit to some of these bands. You know, sometimes we have shows where we may have well, Willie Clayton, the Sir Charles, or TK yeah. Soul, or Tucker. And some kind of way I can go in and kind of ease everybody's mind. You know, you get those egos and you get mm -hmm. all those egos together. And production wise, I can get in and say, hey man, hey, look, don't worry about that. Hey, you're gonna go last, don't worry about it. You're gonna go first, don't worry about it. Get your money, let's do this thing. Let's go on. That's right. That's um, right. And that's needed, especially. That's really needed. Uh, they be surprised what really happens live. Right. Right. Sometimes people don't understand about the live, the live side of this stuff. Uh I've also been production manager for the Jackson Music Awards for a number of years. Uh, mm -hmm. Fair Street Festival, um, and Lynch Street Festival, all those different festivals that we have here. A lot of times I've been stage manager for that. Um, mm -hmm. My cousin, which is Alex Tom Thomas, mm -hmm. uh, he used to do the rhythm and blues deal here. Mm -hmm. and, uh, I did stage manager for him. We did Baby Face, we did Dougie Fresh, we did, mm -hmm. what's it we do? Oh, and we did so many people, I can't, I can't remember. Yeah. And I've been working with Anissa for I don't know how long, mm -hmm. right? With Willie Clayton, uh, we yeah. traveled around with them for a number of years. I, I worked with Willie for years back with Willie and Tyrone, Shirley Brown, all those. Oh wow! Yeah. So you knew a lot of those people personally, a lot Jimmy of people. Taylor and all those, or a lot of people. And I've, I've watched a lot of a lot of these guys come in this thing as kids and they grow up. Uh, a lot of them came in from the gospel side, and I've seen them cross over and become superstars and uh, mm -hmm. a lot of them still held a whole lot of respect for me now. Uh, a lot of people I can pick up the phone and call and say, hey man, how you doing? Just so mm -hmm. I'm good friends with Mel Waiters, can't forget him, man. Oh, wow. And um, it's a, a personal bond. 
you have no choice for what you were doing. Big pardon? I said you had no choice for what you were doing. You know, you're going to eventually meet all you all the people you met. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've been blessed. Now all it to God. Yes, that's what I'm talking about. Right. <laughs> yes. So Tim, so what made you decide to go into the production side of, of things? Oh, didn't really have a choice. I, uh, I grew up in a musical family, so I didn't really have a choice. Um, like I said, I played in the high school band. Didn't think I was that good at that time, but man, I played in the Lions band, all city band. I was really a bad guy. Uh, mm -hmm. I attended Jackson State, but didn't want to major in music, so I majored in mass communications, which kind of got me on this side of where I am now. Uh, uh -huh. So I've just always been around music. It's just I started doing production, just fell in love with it. And um, uh, I kind of label myself as on my stage. When, when, when I'm you on my show, like a Mr. and MB, they're on my stage. I own this stage. Uh, mm -hmm. I yep. set the stage up. Yep. Uh, everything I do is, is my stage. So... Uh -huh. uh, I put you off if you're on there too long. Uh huh. Yeah. yeah you, that's what they say. You never, stage. Yep, you yep. never know who's on Daryl's stage. You never know who's on the stage. So, well, since you've done this for thirty something years, is there something else that you think you would like to do? Oh well, well, wait a minute. I hadn't, I hadn't done actually this particular thing for thirty some years. It's, okay. it's just, I've been around music, you know, different okay. areas of music for thirty years. Um. Right now, I have a, uh, a music group page I started called Soul Music Sessions, and that's just what that, that's what I'm pushing now. Uh, I have a lot of artists on there. I have over, I think, about 2.5k members mm -hmm. all over the world. I got people all out of the country that, that join my page, and they mm -hmm. enjoy they enjoy what I do. Uh, yes, I have, a, I, I have a lot of live performances, uh, recordings of a lot a lot of live performances that were actually on, on my stage. Mm -hmm. and, uh, with the pandemic going on, man, I mean, this is like the celebration of the virtual thing with me. So uh -huh. uh, yeah, go on my page and you can see anybody you want to see. Solo Music Sessions on Facebook. Um, I do a lot, I make a lot of little snippets, snippets if I'm saying it right, for, for different artists, especially upcoming artists. I do mm -hmm. little videos. You send me your music, I do little videos. Mm -hmm. uh, not real expensive. So come on this. I'm not really expensive, so. <laughs> <laughs> I got to, I got to, I got to. I enjoy, I enjoy doing that stuff. And uh, I do have a regular job, nine to five every day. How you doing, Miss Anita? Um, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. His mama say, oh, I know him. I say, yeah, yeah I know. Yeah, yeah. And, uh, you know, I do work every day, and I, I do this in my spare time. So okay. it's, like, it's like something I really enjoy doing. Um, I used to write music a little bit, just kind of bullshit. And I got a lot of songs I ain't done nothing with. I'm gonna give one uh -huh. day she's gonna make us a million dollars. Come on uh, now, come on now, <laughs> come on now, come on with catalog. Okay, with catalog. You know, other than that, I'm just a regular, just a regular guy. So, just ask me anything you want to ask me, because I'm, I'm, I don't know what else to say. <laughs> I know, right? Yeah, I told everybody already. I said he is super, super excited. I think is this your first interview? This is my first interview out of many. Oh, and wow. I granted this to you. Yay! Yay. Yay. That's what I'm talking about. I tell people anytime uh, when I got started in 2018, when I was getting big sexy out, out of there, you were one of the main persons who gave me encouragement, who sent me a message and was like, look, Ham, don't get discouraged. Don't, don't, you know, don't pay attention to all of this, but learn the business of music. Right, right. Because let, let me tell you this: a lot of people don't understand. There's a difference in the in the music business and the business of music. There's yes. So mm -hmm. uh, that's something that I always tell people that's starting out: you got to understand the business. You got to learn the business. Uh, in this business, as you know from some of the larger artists and stuff, when you first start out, oh, you might get taken, and mm -hmm. they call it uh, 101, class 101. You're gonna get taken. And uh, you have to learn from that. Don't get stuck on that because you won't go nowhere. But sometimes you got to give a little bit to get get, get a little bit. Mm -hmm. I ain't saying you got to be no sucker for nobody or nothing like that. But sometimes yeah. you have to give a little bit to get a little bit. Yeah, yeah. I do agree with that. I totally agree with that. Um, it's a big help. Like I said, Daryl and Stevie J as well were um, big help for me when I was first getting started. So I tell anybody to pay it forward. And that's what I've been telling, you know, after the shows, make sure you do that. Love on somebody, pay it forward and make sure 
you know, the same type of information that I was given, I, I make sure I share it with the next person. And it helps them a lot and they thank you for it. So yes, truly, thank you, Daryl, for. And I, I have that clip of you. Uh, we were somewhere in Louisiana when, when you did came out and did, uh, y'all sung for the intermission after Willie took a break. Yeah, John and Angela Walls, y'all all came out and did a song. Yeah, me, Angela, and John. I'm going to post that of, of you singing it. That was, I don't forget. What was that? I think it was Rock Steady or Rock something. Yeah, that's what it was. Yeah. <laughs> Uh-uh, leave that video alone. Uh-uh, that's good. He will get you, too. He'll get you caught up. That's what he said. That was my first video of you, so I'm going to put that out there. Uh-uh, uh-uh, uh-uh. Don't do it. That was early. He and I did record when you sung Equal Opportunity with Willie. Oh, Lord, I was so nervous. I know, and I told you, don't be nervous. Make Willie work. You have to come out there and sing and make him work. And from that point on, you started singing and making everybody work. Yeah, but you know what? And I, I have to give a shout out to Willie Clayton either singing background from him for him and getting to know him on the level when it's quiet, nothing's going on, and he's giving you that nook it, that that extra something for the music business as well for you to take off with. I thank him for that as well because we had some one on ones that is off the charts. You know, he's been and, around and believe me, he knows. He knows. Yes. Yes, he does. So shout out to Willie Clayton too as well. Hey, boss. Yeah, let, me, let, me, let me say a shout out to somebody, to a couple of people. I want to shout yeah. out to all these all these DJs, all the, yeah. uh, all the entertainment professionals in this thing, because it takes all of us to, to make this thing happen. Absolutely, uh, absolutely. It's not an artist and artist thing. I mean, it takes it takes all of us. Mm -hmm. It does. And I did that on Facebook about yeah, a couple of weeks ago, giving shout outs to the DJs, especially because without them or without you, Daryl, promoting the music, none of our stuff will get heard. Right. So, yeah. yes. Appreciate that. Have more people, tell more people that so they can send me some business. You know? Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> look, I have to write that down. So when I do my announcements, I'll be like, y'all come yeah, and talk. Oh, there, now you get to that. I'm going to get all your information when we get off of this live. I'm going to give you so all, all, sure. give you all of it. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna give it all to you. See that? That's what I'm talking about. Hey, what is hey, business hey, over there? Hey, what's the co-host name? I didn't get her name. Huh? What's the co-host name? I didn't get her name. Oh, uh, this, I'm Tam. You can just call Tam. Okay. Tam. Tam Run Tobias. Yeah. Tam Run Tobias. Is what is what is, what is Mrs. Simmons over there doing? Oh, oh, oh! She the one that fixes up so I can get on here. Wait a minute. Turn that camera around. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna bring Mrs. on in here. There you go, sugar pie. Yeah, I am. Hi, there you is. Like those people. <laughs> How you doing, sweetheart? I'm doing fine. Can't I you? see you, you, you really doing well. Cause every time I see Daryl, he's smiling two times bigger. <laughs> That's all yeah, sixty. I'm smiling too. Huh? He said, well, thank you, because I'll be smiling, too. <laughs> See, look at that love. Look at that right there. That love right there. That, 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 that old love uh, right there. That's right. <laughs> that's right, baby. Yes, I told Daryl I see all 82 of his teeth now, not 62. Of <laughs> <laughs> his teeth right now, honey. Yes, I love that love between y'all. That's yeah. why I told him, bring you on. Yeah. Let me see what you want. Thank you so much thank you hey and look and she's one of your biggest fans you didn't know that mm -hmm. well, absolutely when i was doing doing those performances and stuff she'd be sitting right there yeah i, I when i first heard you i was like there who is that girl you know little old nielsen yeah sometimes, sometimes, sometimes i have to tell sometimes i have to come through here and tell her turn that big sexy stuff down <laughs> Uh 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 That's for the ladies, y'all see. That's what's wrong with the men. That's what's wrong with the men. They always want to interfere in our business all the time. Yeah, that big sex ain't for him; it's for us. That's right. Now you know, you know, I don't do nothing like that. <laughs> but I, I'm always singing your song when we get out. You know, we work together. And yeah. we come down the highway, I'll be singing Big Sexy Soul. That's right. You continue to sing it so it can soak into his head. I do. He going to wake up and give you a Big Sexy. Hello. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> oh. That's right. That's what I'm talking about. Hey, hey, since you said that, give me my stuff right here. 
Uh oh. <laughs> what what did what you say? No, you get your cup there. Yeah, since you said that, I think it's time me to take a little sip. Okay. I, 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 come on, we're gonna follow suit. Wait, wait, you wait, you last it. Come on, to the loops. Woohoo! Oh, they already took it. Wait, we 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 we're, we're, we're a little slow. Oh, what happened? We, we, look, what y'all got in y'all cup? Oh. We got some water. Uh, yeah, yeah, we got some tea. We got tea. Tea? <clears throat> y'all got to be better now. What you got? Yeah, put some in that tea now. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Drink it up, baby. Uh, That's how we do it on the Big up. Sexy Show. <laughs> yeah, turn up, turn up, honey. Turn up. <laughs> Listen, I I didn't want to be on here too much longer. We just wanted to let everybody know who Daryl Simmons is and as well as Mrs. Simmons. Uh, the love that y'all have, you know, it shines, baby. It shines. And, and it's real. Really, yeah, and it's real. And a lot of people are looking for that. Mm -hmm. You know, right. us younger folk are looking for that special type of love. So listen, how did you all meet? How what what how did this come about? Uh-oh. Uh, Let me say it. Come well, on. Actually, we, we met on Facebook. Really? And, yeah, we met on Facebook, but we found out that his niece was my best friend in elementary school. And actually, we've been knowing each other since I was in elementary school, actually. He don't remember me because he was older and he was mannish. I was, oh, one of the, I was one of the good girls. Mm -hmm. the truth, um, yeah. We've been knowing each other since we were little, really. Really? Since that, that, is, that is the truth. Yeah. And uh, it wasn't our managed. I just didn't mess with the good girls. I was a good girl. They weren't being managed, but, you know, the yes, good girls. Yes, because you was messing with the bad girls. You right. were managed. <laughs> well, when the light came on, we was in the house. He was still outside. Oh, he was still outside. <laughs> I got you on that one. That's a, and how long have you all been married? Six years. Six years. Coming up six wow. years. Oh, wow. February. It's been we got, we got an anniversary coming up in February. Right. February what? 22nd. She got it oh, right. 22nd. 22nd. I'm going to write that one down. And Big Sexy, tomorrow's my birthday. That's right. Tomorrow. <laughs> Get you a big sexy, get you a big sexy baby. Hey, that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> right, talking about. That's awesome. So you all work together, right? Right. We're we're in different departments, but we work at the same place. No, you mean you all actually work at the same place? I thought right. you were gonna have that. Oh, y'all work together. Oh, that's so we ride together every day. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's that awesome. That's beautiful. That's, right. that's awesome. Wow. See, you know, with single people be running around here trying to, you know, trying to look for love and find love. And we we not good at it. We not it's good coming. at it. It's, it's but, but you know what, you know, so we uh we've been married before and we went through a divorce. And mm -hmm. uh, I had gave up on love and he did too. Mm -hmm. And I, I, it was just the grace of God that we met on Facebook. See, yeah. and, and I'm looking for nobody, just happened. See, that's what I'm talking about. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna have to write a song about y'all, right? Uh -huh. Go ahead, girl. I'm gonna write a song about y'all. It's gonna call what we're gonna call it Sugar Love. Sugar Love, <laughs> <laughs> let's call it Sugar Love, baby. I'm talking about that good, good type, yeah, lyrical music that we used to hear years ago, you know, with mm -hmm. the Temptations, Smokey Robinson, yes. and stuff like that. We, yeah, we need to put, we need to pump up a song. We give, we give y'all permission. Yeah, we give y'all permission. <laughs> give you permission. See, that's what I'm talking about. Right. Don't, right. don't make me gonna get started. I'm gonna be writing tonight. Listen, okay. <laughs> right. Listen, let me see if I can write out this production. See, and Tamron <laughs> writes out scripts. She does productions as well, too. Oh, okay. Daryl, so that can kind of coincide together, huh? Yeah. Right. Okay. Yeah, that can go inside together. So when she start getting, you know, some yeah, some I tell play. you, y'all can use us, but every time you sing it, and when y'all get big, we gotta sit out front. You doggone no, I ain't let y'all <laughs> sit out front. Y'all be backstage. Right. Okay. <laughs> okay. You okay. If you want to sit out there, you can, but it's VIP strictly for y'all. You got okay. to understand. There ain't too many people that can get there. 
Right. Now, right. Come on. We rolling that. Right. Did you get you got something that you want to talk to them about? No, I just want to say that it's beautiful to see black love. It really is. Right. Like, you look at people mm-hmm. who are like in love. It's also great when you can see people who are love and they don't have to say it, but you can see it. You can right. see it. So that's 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 very important. Right. Man, that, that that's powerful coming from you because I've never met you just my first time ever seeing you before in my life. And you say I something. Mean, her and her sister Erica over here tripping. She on the side. <laughs> she trying to get the comments and stuff. But these two sisters I met months ago in, in 2020. And ever since then, they are great. They are powerful sisters. Then you ain't got no mess with them. You know, they're not into that negative stuff. Yeah. That's, that's great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you need some people like that in your corner too as well. Exactly. Uh, yeah. Listen, just look. I'm, I'm, I'm proud of you. What you, what you're doing. Uh, Thank you. Something entertainment, just big time. And, I mean, just hey. wow. I mean, hey. they ain't got no t-shirt, <clears throat> but uh, <laughs> well, <laughs> ain't got no t-shirt. From, uh, everybody, uh, everybody, uh, everybody uh, advertise their t-shirts when I'm out on the road. So I ain't got no t-shirt, but it's hey, all right. You, I'm gonna have to get. I gotta give wifey the the one with the glitter. You gonna have yeah. to get the other. Yes. It doesn't have a glitter on it. So I get a me and the other shirts. Okay, I always get one too. I always get one. I'm gonna get with y'all so I can get y'all sizes because I believe I got both of y'all sizes here okay. at the house anyway. So that'll be just perfect. I'm gonna try to hook y'all up. Get y'all. Look, let, 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 let me get back to saying what I'm saying. I'm, I'm proud of what you what you've done. I mean, I've I seen you grow. Um, I mean, I don't watch you grow in this industry just like I watch a lot of other, other people, you know. Mm-hmm. Uh, I'm just proud of what you're doing. I mean, you, you, thank you. Thank you so you much. You ran with it and, you, and you're still running. So, yes, yes. And they had to find me something else, a little nookie, something else for me to get into because I can not only just sing, I can talk, I can you know, right. I try to make people laugh. You know, it's a lot of things that's under the umbrella of Big Six that people don't know about. So I'm just trying to branch out and get my feel on to where I need to be placed. So I think this is a good spot to start. Yeah, you the right sure road. Is. It sure is. And look, and look, you got to you got to keep my good friend Ron Cabo in your corner. That's a good guy. Got to, got to. I've been the one for a long time. Yeah, yeah. Yes. I have to keep him in my pocket. That's right. He's a wonderful brother too, and I give my shout out to Soul Kitchen to him. So I make sure I can put some love on him. Yeah, Soul Kitchen. Soul musician, yeah. all that soul. See that? Yes, absolutely. So listen, we have done a great job, don't you think? How you feel, there? Well, I feel great. Man, look, I was so nervous I wasn't going to get in. I was about to get my car right over there with you. <laughs> <laughs> and you sure could have. We would have just stuck you in another room. <laughs> but I, I, I really appreciate you allowing me you know, uh, to come on your show. Especially being the first person of the new year, yes, the year that we're losing a, a president, and I just feel so good and honored. <laughs> yeah, you know that's a whole nother conversation on that one, right there. Yeah, we're, not gonna, we're not gonna go there. We're not gonna go there. But I, I really appreciate it. Yeah, that whole conversation need prayer and supplements. Yes, and Lord. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> but it's gonna be okay. I think twenty twenty one is gonna put us right back where we were yeah. before yeah. all this stuff started going on. You know. And, and it's given us a chance to, to meet new people, even though it's on Zoom, uh, different phone calls. You know, it's it's different folk I've met so far in this pandemic that I've never met ever, and probably would have never seen. Never seen, right. but it's, it's yeah, it's bringing a lot of people together, and it's showing you know we can network better like that too. Exactly. Right. Right. Right other space you know we can we can really network and get some stuff done so i'm excited this year i hope to be doing some more things with you dale um you can go on and put me on the list so i can start um using your services mm-hmm. amen praise the lord don't do that, don't do that. and Nelson, he does a great yeah. job too he We're does a great, great job, job. Yes, yeah, you ought to see Erica over here with her afro flying side to side. <laughs> she felt that one, baby. It was not, 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 right. Right. Erica's not coming on camera. Huh? Not Erica's not coming on camera. She's scared. Uh, she's scared. Yeah. Erica no, over here, too. She, she, look, she handling the comments. She handling the... You want to get up and say hey to everybody? 
<laughs> you got it. She, she gets up so she can show. Can you, can you, you can might have to come on this one. Can you see? And she has a big fro, she so does. just realize it's shaking from side to side. Because <laughs> she said she felt that. Yeah. <laughs> so listen, Dara, I want to thank you so much. I know this will not be the last time because we're going to get you back on here again. And we're going to mix it up with probably some more artists that you know of. And have uh, have their music that uh, you probably got their music and been sharing it. So I wanted to bring in like several people for your first interview. I just wanted it to be you and you by yourself, mm -hmm. and to bring in wifey because you know I love the ladies. Yeah, yeah we love got, the we got, ladies. Hey, hey, we got one more. We got oh, one. You got a dog. We got one more guest. We got one. Oh, oh, get on, cute. Hey, what's his name? Daisy. It's a girl. No, he. This a boy. Jazzy. He said Daisy. Jazzy. Jazzy. Oh, Daisy. Okay. He ain't gonna know what you're saying after a while. Daisy, <laughs> David, <laughs> Daniel. We don't know. He is so cute. Oh, yeah. I love dogs. Thank you. Oh, I love dogs. Oh, that's just right up my ass. See, you made my night right there. Thank you. Thank you. I love it. So listen. We're not gonna hold you like I said. I'm gonna, I'm gonna stop talking. You got something else you want to say? No, just ladies, check your DMs. You know, you can still find love in the DMs. I'm just saying, <laughs> don't, don't, give don't give up. Don't give up. You know what? That's the name of the song I interviewed Scoop the Truth. Um, on Instagram last week, and the name of one of his songs is called Don't Give Up. He's a rapper, you gotta check it out. Right. This is a song that you can exercise to, you know, cleaning up the house too. It's called Don't Give Up by Scoop the Truth. Okay. All right. You All right. We're gonna look that one up. So check him out. He's a rapper. So yeah. That'll be that'll be for that one. But Erica, you have anything you wanna you wanna oh, say? I enjoyed everything. Everything was nice and lovely. It's just beautiful. She said everything's so love, nice and lovely love. and beautiful. Oh, <laughs> He, she, she's a mess. <laughs> so listen, we want to say from the Big Sexy Show how much we love y'all, yes. how much we respect y'all, and how much we want to just show a little something, something to you. We just want to push. Love you guys too. Push that. Right. We love you guys too. Thank you very much. Yes. And thank you. Um, did we want to we want to give up our let's let's yeah, let's give a toast one more time. I don't think they really understand what that means, honey. Come on, put it up there. Put it up there. Y'all got it? Let's take that sip. Come on, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Wait a minute. Woo. Honey, I got wine in mine, and I think it went the other way. <laughs> Y'all got tea and water. I'm trying to be safe. <laughs> but listen, without further ado, we're just going to go on and let you on off this thing, but we're going to say Happy New Year to y'all. Thank you. Yes, 2020 is going to be great for us, honey. Y'all be safe. And make sure for the Big Sexy Show, y'all, as I always tell y'all, make sure you love on somebody and pay it forward. Okay? All right, y'all. Hey, I, I, hey, I, got, I, got I got one more thing to say. What you want to say? Right. I want everybody to go to Facebook and go to Soul Musicians. Check it out. Give them some likes, some love, and all that good stuff. So uh, music sessions. So music, music sessions on Facebook. If he ain't on there every day, is every other day. You he's there every well, day. Well, I, I I know you check it out. Then. <laughs> yeah, every time I look up, it's a watch party. It's a watch party. It's a watch right. party. Click, click, click. Right. Yeah. So we on that soul music sessions, y'all. Go check it out on Facebook with Daryl Simmons. You never know. Who's on Daryl stage, y'all? That's what he says every time. So yes, love y'all. Y'all be good. All right, peace. And we'll see y'all. Bye. All right. Bye, bye. Bye. See you later. All right. All right. <laughs>